What is up everyone? JD here. I hope you're all doing well today. Today we're going to be drawing the winner for the 3000 giveaway subscription prizes. Let's get into it. So this should be a relatively short straightforward video i'm going to grab the link i've already posted the rules so everyone should be aware of what those are we are going into the silk browser going to be using the random comment picker here entering the oops oh what's going on there there we go entering oh let me get this out of here entering the url for the um where's the keyword there we go sorry <laughs> the keyword was thumbhole for the grand prize winner and uh second and third place winner i am sorry multitasking apparently this morning eludes me all right no we're not going to include replies and i don't reply on these if you wonder why just to keep the comment count down all right we're going to load up the comments now we have 72 comments Let's pick a winner. Clarence Davis, I recently modified my Spydercode PM2. I'd like to see a video of different mods available for the PM2, especially Thumbhole Kit. Oh, sorry, the Thumbhole Kit to make it a front flipper. Hmm, interesting. My PM2 now has the lime green scales, blue titanium pocket clip, backspacer, lanyard tube, and all the screws. My blade is the black S30V. Nice knife. Uh, looks really nice. Just wondering how the front flipper works. Thanks for the opportunity. Keep up the good work, bro. Okay, so the first person that'll be in the final three is going to be, I'm going to write this down really quick, Clarence Davis and Mods. I'm just going to make a quick note to myself. I'll come back and look up the comment. All right, let's go to the second pick. And remember, as I pick these, I'm going to go in order of the recommendations. So the second one, G-Man, I haven't seen G-Man on here in a little while. Let's see here, G-Man1024. All right, congratulations on 3 Thay. Thanks, man, I appreciate that. Uh, awesome milestone, love the thumbhole mod on that, Craig. Looks cool, great job by Jay Dizzle. I agree, my man. I'd like to get that done to my sheepdog. So jelly since they've started coming out with them. Oh, the thumbhole, so you must have the flipper tab, I'm assuming. Uh, but weren't uh, yeah okay but weren't available back when I got mine. I don't remember seeing a video of it, so my recommendation idea would be to show how you store your knives and toys. Thank you, JD. Cool idea. I've never really actually thought about knife storage. Let me write that down. Knife storage. All right, let's get our third and final contender. Travis R, congrats on 4K. It's 3K, my brother, but I like where your head's at. That's where we're going next. You are moving right along. I'd like to see some button lock front flippers compared to them. I'm sorry, compare them as well and do a battle of the button locks. I've done a few of these, but I like the idea. Um, so we'll put yours down for the thumb hole battle. Or I'm sorry, the button lock battle. The thumb hole's the keyword. Sorry, my man. All right, Travis R. So... I am, I've done mods and I've done the button lock battles before, um, and they're a little bit older, so if you're newer to the channel, it might be why you haven't seen it. So I haven't done the knife storage, so I'm going to go with G-Man. You're going to get the top prize pack. I like that knife storage idea, and I had not thought about that or thought about doing that, so I, I appreciate the suggestion. Uh, since I really like doing mods a little bit more than the blade battles because I'm more of a mechanical type person, I like to tinker and things of that nature, I am going with Clarence for the number two. And Travis, that means you have the number three prize pack. So I know a little bit different and definitely very selective because I'm kind of just going off the ideas. Not to say that one idea is better than the other. The reason I'm thinking G-Man because I haven't seen, I haven't done the knife storage and I've done mods and button uh, blade battles. So the button lock blade battle, I've done a couple of those are not bad suggestions, which is why I did those videos. I really like them a lot. I hate looking at myself in the reflection there, <laughs> but 
Um, I've done those and will continue to do those, which is why it is a good suggestion. It's just something that I've kind of done in the past. And, you know, those button lock videos, button lock battles that I've done, they're a little bit older. Uh, I think I did the, I don't know, I think the Altus against the, what's the one from Kaiser? The original? I believe it's called the original. And the mods, I love doing mods clearance. I do them a lot, which is um, not a bad suggestion. I know that you were saying specifically the Spyderco mod. I only have a Shaman and a... Actually, I have a Shaman, a Smock, and the Manix 2 currently, and all three are modded. <laughs> so it would be a little hard to do that, but I am going to keep the idea for future videos, and I think what I'm going to also do a little bit later, I'm just going to go through a video where I pull this up on the laptop and do a screen share and just go through the ideas because I saw a bunch that were really cool. I want to catalog them, and I want to shout out to the people that took the time to make the comment and the suggestion because I know, you know, it seemed like for the majority you were putting some thought into it and i really appreciate that so i would like to make a list you have to come to me to get them not chasing anybody down and congratulations thanks for all the support all the love all the comments i appreciate and love you guys i hope you have a fantastic week until next time peace